this area is a hot spot for, for sharks? And rays. It's a hot spot for sharks and rays. So it's not just the leopard sharks we see in La Jolla. It's all different species of sharks and rays. And we don't exactly know why they are, they're all attracted to this site, but that's part of the ongoing research here. Birch Aquarium is the public outreach center for UC San Diego researchers. My name is Andy Nosel, and I'm a marine biologist at Scripps Institution of Oceanography. And my lab is basically right behind me. Perched on a bluff overlooking the Pacific Ocean, the aquarium puts on a shark-themed exhibit for visitors every summer. The big question this year, where do these harmless leopard sharks go in the winter? We've tagged about 30 sharks in La Jolla with these pop-up satellite transmitters that have been programmed to detach from the shark during the winter, this coming winter, float to the surface and wherever they are they'll transmit to a satellite their position and then I'll get an email finally telling us where these sharks go in the winter. From sharks to one of the sea's most captivating creatures, birch is one of a few aquariums attempting to breed sea dragons in captivity. This cousin of the seahorse is actually a fish found only off the coast of Australia. Leslie Matsushige has been with the aquarium for 22 years. We've raised up to 13 species of uh, seahorses here and um, you know, have sent over 2,000 seahorses out to other aquariums around the country and the world. And so that's what we hope to achieve with this sea dragon propagation program. They may resemble a dragon, but only grow to about 19 inches long. Dwayne Brown, KPBS News.